All right, all right, happy Friday. Travis here with Modern Bay Company. Uh, today, we're just gonna do a two minute tidbit on throttle body reverser and specifically on the electrical connections. So quick rundown here, when you're doing a Subaru conversion into a Volkswagen Bay window bus, like we are, like we do, um, you're gonna need one of these guys, which is a throttle body reverser. This one is the Modern Bay Special um, version 1.0 right here. Actually, it's like version three, but to the public, to you guys, this is 1.0 that we're actually uh, putting out there uh, for people to be able to uh, buy and use in their conversions. It will we, it's what we use in all of our in-house conversions. So uh, cool thing real quick about this guy is the angle on these flanges, uh, perfect so that um, we minimize the height, uh, but it still has the perfect uh, routing for reversing the throttle body on here. So that's cool. This isn't about this piece, but it's cool. We also have this piece um, that's again one of our custom pieces. So uh, the throttle cable goes up through here and connects directly with this guy um, to be able to allow you to actually, uh, you know, push the gas on your bus. So, um, so that's that guy. It's perfect mount spot for it. If you have cruise control, that's what this guy's for. Most people don't, but um, that's that uh, for there. So that's the setup here. Now this is kind of rad because uh, this guy. Uh, this in particular is from a 2001 uh, Outback and it was from a manual. So the setup on this is a little bit different uh, than for the automatics, but it's roughly all the same here. Uh, anyway, the principle is the same for what we're doing today. So uh, as you can see right here, uh, this connection uh, to this sensor right here, which is the manifold absolute pressure sensor, um, it actually still fits. It still routes, uh, but it's got a little bit too much of a, a bend in it for my preference. So uh, not only am I going to extend this one a little bit, uh, this guy going up here uh, to the idler control valve, it just doesn't quite fit. I might be able to make it fit if I wanted to, but I don't like working like that. So I'm going to extend this guy probably two to three inches to make a nice easy connection because you don't want to stress uh, the points on this electrical connector because over time they will, uh, they can fray, they can, um, if they're stressed over time, they can actually disconnect at some point then you'll be chasing some electrical issue that you don't want to chase. So that's these two guys. And then over here, the throttle position sensor, it's right here. That's just a no-go, right? So I've reversed this throttle, pos throttle position sensor. Uh, Busaroo Mick, a while back, uh, he's got a YouTube video on how to do that. And so that's where I learned that trick. Thanks, Mick, I uh, hugely appreciate it. Uh, and then also uh, I'm going to cut and splice to extend this probably by five or six inches there. Again, so I just have a nice smooth uh, connection point uh, to the throttle position sensor. So um, just to let you rest easy, if you're doing this, there's no real magic to it. Um, you, you cut it, you splice it. If any of these wires were shielded wires, uh, then we would actually need to replace with the like uh, wire and the shielding um, and extend it as such. But these aren't, so you can extend them, you're fine. Um, and then we'll, we'll get this guy going. All right, so that's a wrap on extending this harness. Uh, so as you can see here, this guy got extended, comes right back here. Um, he'll get kind of buttoned down so he's not free floating, but um, this connects nicely right there with the throttle position sensor. Um, this harness, so you gotta watch your clearance up here. Uh, we'll tie these back um, so that they don't have any sharp runs, but they're uh, nice and snug, not interfering uh, with the activation of the throttle right there. Um, everything's taped off in split loom, um, looking good and ready to function for uh, Reggie, the bus right behind me uh, that belongs to Matt. So uh, super excited to continue on this bus, but that is, um, what do we call it? Two cents tidbit, tidbit, tech tidbit, two minute tidbit, whatever that is <laughs> uh, for today. Mm -hmm. There we go. Holler at me if you have any questions on extending your um, engine harness to your throttle body once it's been relocated. Also, you know, if you want one of these guys, um, they're hot. Get them while they're hot. <laughs> <laughs> uh, not really, not hot. They're good. They're uh, they're good pieces pieces of kit. So, and it comes with this, which is also super nice to have. So, um, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys, and we'll talk to you soon.